Hey up guys, Bravely and I here and welcome to episode number 34 of our Pokemon White Randomizer Nuzlocke Challenge. Today we are starting the post game. So that's already spoiled the last episode for you guys. But uh, yeah, if you did go and miss, if you, bit, blah, 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 if you did miss that last episode, then please do go and check it out. Because uh, we actually took on an Angetsis and came out on top and managed to technically beat the Nuzlocke. You know, we, we, beat, we beat the final boss, which is great. Now, there is a post-game. We are going to do the post-game because there is an Elite Four Round 2. There are other champion battles. Um, there are um, other difficult, more a lot more difficult rival battles. There's like half a region left to explore, which we're not, I'm not so sure about. I, when everybody I've spoken to about this has said, yeah, the post-game of Pokemon White is not that great. But um, I don't, I genuinely don't know. I've never really played White, so we're gonna see what what's going on and uh, and check it out. So we're we're gonna be loading up in Nuvema Town. So if you're excited for this episode of the Pokemon White Randomizer and lot, then please do leave a like, comment, and subscription down below. You know that I appreciate all of your interaction. Let's get started. We do not want to launch the C Gear functions. It is winter. And uh, we are back in our bedroom. Nothing kicking off, nothing kicking off just yet. Nothing kicking off just yet. So let's have a quick team recap of the squad. The champion beating squad. We have got Bill, the level 48, Blastoise with Surf, Crunch, Aquatail, and Strength. We've got Gaia, the level 48, Torterra with Earthquake, Strength, Bullet Seed, and Crunch. Taylor, the level 50, uh, Excadrill with Earthquake, Razor Leaf, Rock Slide, and Sword Stance. Primal level 47 Kyogre with Surf Ice Beam, Body Slam, and Ancient Power. Shelob level 44, who got one kill in the entire Elite Four. With Sucker Punch, uh, Pimisile, Nightshade, and Shadow Sneak. And we've got Bacon here on the squad at the moment, who's kind of just a placeholder in the team scene as we lost Krusty during the uh, Elite Four. So that's our team at the moment. Why is he, why is he in... I suppose they, they look alike. Welcome home, Leon. Seems like you've been through so amazing things. Or is it not so? Incredible, really. Amazing, absolutely, meeting these two Pokemon of legend. Ah, this is... Uh... Oh, I still wear my disguise. Pardon. Or rather, let me introduce myself. Oh. Oh. Looker. Okay. I'm a gold trotting elite of the International Police. My name is Ah. No. I shall inform you of my code name only. My code name it is Looker. It is how I am called. Behind the scenes in this region of Universe, a organization called Team Plasma conspires. This I have heard, and therefore, to this region I must come, but thanks to the gym leaders and you, yes, Team Plasma's castle has fallen. And the members, they have gone upon their separate ways. Hmm, this is what I hear most certainly. But however, however, but, the ones known as the Seven Sages, still, they hide themselves in the Unova region. And so, in the end, it explains why I must ask this of you, trainer of amazing skill. Travel the Unova region and search it up, and search it down, for the Seven Sages. Alder, the champion of renown, recommended you to my notice. Are you willing to help me? Sure. Excellent, I thank you. Now I feel as if I have perhaps a million people on my side. Permit me to give you this into your hands. Oh, he's giving me a super rod. That's a super rod, right? Yes, correct. It is certainly a super rod. Are we talking about Team Plasma Seven Sages? What does this have to do with looking for those people? Ha! Ah, I see. It is truly Leon's mama to ask so. What a magnificent question. I admire it. It is my pleasure to answer. Absolutely nothing. I see. Yes, I shall surprise provide the explanation of this. The super rod. First, face the water and then play the rod. Second, concentrate your focal point. When it occurs that these Pokemon bite, exclamation point will indicate. Immediately reel in. For the rest, Leon, I depend upon you. Okay. Well, that's a little bit weird to give me a, a, a fishing rod, but you know, it's not 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 that helpful. Hey, Leon, is looking through talking to you? I'm sorry. By the time I went to get the straight on city gym leaders, everything was over. 
if that is the case, I let Getsis escape when the Shadow Triad are creating an opening. Getsis, the Shadow Triad? I'll tell you later about what happened in the castle. It is more important to ask what you plan to do now, Bianca. You know what? You know what? I'm going to go to White Forest. And that's the city on the other side of Route 16 where you leave from Nimbasa City. Hmm. If you go that way, you might be able to meet all sorts of Pokemon you've never seen before. Uh, it's all kicking off here. Oh, this is Juniper's dad, isn't it? Oh, this is nice timing. Well, I see you're all here. Just a moment ago, I got some National Pokedex data from an acquaintance. Since you're here, let's upgrade your Pokedexes with the National Pokedex data. I'm sure you'll be visiting a wider range of places. Naturally, it means you'll be encountering more Pokemon. Let me see your Pokedex for a sec. There you go, Bianca. Next up is Charon. And last but not least, we get the National Pokedex. We don't need the National Pokedex. We've been encountering National Pokemon for a long time. You can now switch your Pokedexes to the National Mode Pokedex. Completing the National Pokedex will surely be a big challenge. So take your time, enjoy yourself, and meet lots of Pokemon. Wow, the National Pokedex. It looks like there are tons of Pokemon I don't know yet. Oh, I get to show my mum and dad my Pokedex too. I, 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 let's meet again somewhere, okay? Oh, Bianca is as impetuous as ever, no matter what is going on. I think I'll travel all the way around Universe starting at Route 1 again. I'm sure I'll discover lots of new things. Could be I'll encounter the Seven Sages along the way. And Leon, if we spy each other along the way, let's battle again, okay? So, this is it. This is the post-game. We've got to find the Seven Sages. And... That's it. So, let's head up to Route 1. I don't want to really encounter anything. Because this is just going to be nothing but trash. But I need a Pokemon Center. Because I want to sort our team out. Absolutely nothing but trash. Nothing but trash on these routes. Absolutely nothing but trash. Nothing but trash. A level 2 Rayquaza. God, I wish that we caught that at the start of this playthrough. What did we catch on Route 2? Congratulations, more wallpapers were added. Okay. I, I don't care. Right, we want to sort our team out. Because, um... Let's be honest here. We don't really want bacon on the squad. Um, I... I'm really tempted. Do we have? Do we actually have a? a hang on. Let me let me sort these. Items have been sorted. Have we ever picked up a? No, we've never picked up a magmarizer. Can we buy one? Can you buy magmarizers in Pokemon White? This is um. This is important. A uh, Magma Riser Pokemon White. Where do you find Magma Riser in black and white? Route 13, a guy will give you one rare item every day. This is the one that, uh, one of the items you can receive. That kind of sucks. We have route thirty. Well, let's let's go to route thirteen. I'm just gonna I'm just gonna put bacon in the PC and bring out Martha because we're gonna we're gonna try that. We, if we get a magmarizer immediately right now. Then I'm gonna, I'm gonna definitely take Magby. I mean, I might anyway just have a Magma. And where's Route 13? Oh, we're not there yet. Oh, fair enough. Okay. I feel like we, we should be like 
continuing our way around. So I think I think I'm gonna go to our Pellucid City and start continuing our way around. I am gonna take Magby into the squad. I'm gonna get a Magmar. I'm gonna see what the what its stats are like. And maybe take it from there. I I may swap out um Shelob as well. So we'll put Magby in the squad. And Honestly, I'd really like to take Screech the Trap Inch. I feel like we should have taken him quite a while ago. But what's what's Bacon's stats like? 78 special attack, 90 special defense. He's not bad. Oh, he's, no, he's not great. No, I just looked at his level and that's not great. Whereas uh, Trap Inch here is an awful nature. Well, it's not an awful nature. It just doesn't power up his attack. I don't know. We've got Shinobi. It gives us that quad ice weakness. The two quad ice weaknesses. But we've also got a couple of water types that and a fire type now that resist that. So Yeah, we're gonna take Trap Inch. Uh, I may regret this choice. But uh, let's give him the experience, yeah. Because there's no point. Should I give Blazer the experience share? I'll give Blazer the experience share. Because he'll evolve next level. He'll evolve in one level. So, we're a few levels off getting a flag on anyway. So, it's kind of worth doing it. So, let's... There's a Pokemon Outbreak at Route, route 11. Hang on. Does this mean that Thunderous is around? Legendary. And this is ten, this is our first encounter. Hang on. This is this is our first encounter on this route. The Nuzlocke rules are still in effect. And if if it was the case of um I can't believe how lucky we've just gone. Uh, if it was a case of just like um, this is the second encounter, or I, you know, I'd already encountered something. Then I encountered Thunderous. I wouldn't catch it just because it's a legendary. But this is the first encounter on the route. I was expecting it. It's not randomised. I was expecting it to be randomised. It's going to run away. So I'm going to master ball it. I'm going to Master Ball it. We're getting a Thunderous. We're getting a Thunderous. I feel like I was still holding down and beat them. <laughs> I, I feel like that's not going to go well. Like, But we're in post-game now, so it doesn't really matter. But with the Nuzlocke is still in effect. But that was the first, that was the first encounter. The only thing is, it's not randomised. So, we are going to give a nickname to Thunderous. It is going to count. And I do apologise if you don't like that. What are we going to call it? Um, uh, we normally call... We normally call Altari as Nimbus. Um... Who's I mean do we just call it do we just call it Thor? Have we ever had a Pokemon called Thor before? 
Thor the God of Thunder. Have we ever had a Pokemon called Thor? I don't think we have. So we're just going to have Thor. Thor the Thunderous. Okay, what would our first encounter... Have? Our first encounter would have been a Paris. <sighs> We're keeping the Thunderous. We're keeping the Thunderous. Yeah, um... Oh. Well, hopefully this guy... Oh, this... He's in... He's in French. He's talking French to me. Preschooler Daniel has got a very good grasp of the French language. Oh. Oh. <sighs> okay, Misty's guillotine. I need to press another. He says some sword signs. Okay, we need to get out of this area. We need to get out of this area. We've gone the wrong way. So maybe we follow Bianca. We got quite lucky that that wasn't a legendary then. We got quite lucky that that was not a legendary. Um... It's got Prankster. Thunderous, Electric Flying, Revenge, Shockwave, Heal Block, and Agility. It's got Special Attack Lowering Nature, which sucks. So it's actually got a higher attack than Special Attack. But all of its stats are pretty well rounded. It's going in the party. We're, we're, we're going to just uh, fly down to... Where... Um, Where Bianca's gone. So we'll go down to Nimbasa City instead. And we're going to take Thunderous into the squad. You better believe we are taking Thunderous into the squad. Thor, get here. I'll look in between episodes for any uh, TMs it can perhaps learn. But it's a good addition to the squad. That is a good addition to the squad. Right. We're going to try heading to the right from here. Which will be another encounter. Hi. To Route 16 and Marvelous Bridge. Ah, no, I got an encounter here. I remember getting an encounter here. Because these guys are going to be dead weak. Because you can access this area before, yeah. When you're in Nimbasa City. So let's just kill these quick. Just kill these quick. Get it over and done with. Alright. Oh, uh, yeah, we're gonna have to battle our way through all this. We didn't bother doing this before. Sorry for the speed up, but you guys don't need to see this. So, yeah, it's at the bridge where they would be shut us off before, I guess.
stop following me? I'm not getting that out. Hi. Just made my day. The vending machine gave me an extra drink for free. Give me an extra drink. I don't know. It's not going to give me an extra drink, so stop this. Parasol inside the gate. Well, I really don't want to get wet and dirty. It's inside, love. Oh, look at this bridge. So long, I have a deal for you and you alone. Here's your chance. I will sell you the secret Pokemon Magikarp for an unbelievable $500. How about it? Really? Really? I'll do it in between episodes. It might be randomized. That's why I'm thinking of doing it. Hey, the Shadow Triad are here. You, huh? Get it is gone. He went off somewhere alone after we rescued him from the castle. From the day he gets his saved our lives, we have sworn to be loyal to him. Even now, after he orders us not to search for him. Also gets his said to give you this. An adamant orb. Okay. As well as this. Okay. And this also. Okay. Guess this. Where did he find these? Was he, what was he planning to do with them? Why did he give them to you? There is no way to know. Or is he testing you? Or using you? We, the Shadow Triad, have always been and always will be loyal servants of Gessis. And Gessis' ambitions will never cease. Never shall we meet again. Farewell. Okay, I'm kind of glad to be away from them for... again. This is a very long bridge. It's very nice, but it's a very long bridge. Are there actually Pokemon on this bridge? Hang on. I'm not sure. I'm not sure that you can get a Pokemon. Even if you can, I can't be bothered to. That guy's just... Well, basically, he's um, doing, like, customer surveys and stuff like that. Oh, rotation battle. Okay, what level are you going to be at? Because this this is concerning. Typhlosion, Tyranitar, and Moltres. This girl is not hanging about. Four... Everything level 65. I knew she was going to go to the Tyranitar. This is going to hurt. <clears throat> I can't risk going around to Torterra because that's going to happen. Okay, so it goes for the heat wave again. What what even is this? Why is everything level sixty five? Why? We 
just have to, like, wait until we live one of those heat waves or the Typhlosion miss misses Inferno. Because that'll happen. A crunch is going to do even more. Oh, yeah, it is. And I don't know how we beat this Tyranitar. In Inferno is supposed to miss half the time. We die to a Tyranitar earthquake. I don't know what to do. Okay, we, we're living this. Oh, I forgot, I forgot to full restore for the band. <clears throat> I messed up. Okay, she air slashes. Which does more? Heat wave. Okay, I've killed the Moltres. Typhlosion doesn't kill me. I'm sure Inferno is supposed to have 50% um, accuracy like that kind of. I'm sure it is. But I have no idea how to kill this Tyranitar now. sure what to do here. I have to go out into Primal and I have to hope that I can kill. Bill's gone. Why is everything level 65? We get a crit back and we kill the Tyranitar. Oh, I was not ready. No, I just stayed in with the Blastoise. Well, Magby's evolving. <sighs> Blazer evolved into a Magma. I, I, I'm just concerned that, like, the next... Everyone's going to have the same level 65 Pokemon. I'm going to put Primal out front just in case. And I'm going to find out. And I'm going to put the experience share. On Thor. He's got four Pokemon. If they're all level 65, I'm dead. 62. He still might be dead. Oh, 
Unfortunately, this Hound Doom can't really do that much to me. Well, he doesn't know. Escavalier. I've got a magma. But can it live? I've got Rock Slide on Taylor. I feel like Taylor might be my better bet. Is this part steel? Yeah, it is. And this is going to hurt. Okay, didn't hear that much. This is silly. Why? Resisted. Okay. I'm sorry, guys. I don't understand what I'm what I'm missing here. Why? Why is there nowhere to train up for this level? Oh god. Right. I uh, I I have to kill here. Okay. I had to kill otherwise Taylor was going down. I'm about to send in a semi pool. Do we outspeed this? I don't think we do. Scavely is really slow, isn't it? That's why we outsped that. I shouldn't have stayed in there. I hit back before I knew what I was doing. I think he's killing me from full. Because we're in the rain. So I have to hope that I outspeed. He used Fury Splash. What an idiot. What an idiot. He just choked. He just choked. He could have killed me. Hydro Pump would have killed. Hydro Pump would have killed. And thankfully, I've got two sword stances up. What am I supposed to do? Why, where am I supposed to go? Arcanine. Again. Fire blasts me, I'm dead. Alright, uh, this time though, I can switch out to Primal. I have to switch out to Primal. This episode has just gone south. We've got a Thunderous. But I don't know what to do now. Gotta heal up, see how much damage he does. I don't think he can do much to me. He can extreme speed. There we go. How much is this going to do? Okay. In, yeah, that's fine. The Surf. The Oda Sleuths. It's even better. Oh. That was not a good trial, guys. We're on Route 15. I don't want to be on Route 15. I don't know what I'm supposed to do. Our first encounter? That was a complete accident. I didn't mean to go into this. Our, we've just encountered a Yamask. It's our first encounter. Um, I'd like to catch this. Okay, we're trapped in. I'd like to catch this. Kofa Grigus is not a bad Pokemon. Yamas does evolve into Kofa Grigus, doesn't it? 
Ooh, we came very close to killing that. We don't have a whole lot of... of balls. Got it. Uh, these Pokemon arose from the spirits of people in interred in graves of pit past ages. Each retains memories of its former life. Alright, giving it an into your mask. I would like to give a nickname to it. Um, um, King Tut. King Tut. Okay, this is not what I was expecting at all. We just caught a Yamask. And nearly died. So, this episode has been very strange. I'm not sure what to make of this post game. Oh, really? Really? Really, you are about to face my wrath. You are about to face my wrath. You just fake me out, how dare you. We are running over right now, I understand that. But I want to get back to the um, the Pokemon Center right now and just heal up and, and go and hold this funeral for Bill. I was about to say, don't stare the explosion, because the explosion wouldn't kill but... What's he just done? What did he do? Did he use bide? Alright. So in between episodes, I am going to look up what, what I'm supposed to be doing here. Because obviously I can't go and battle a load of level 60 Pokemon at the level that I am. I could try. But, you know, we've already just seen that, that that comes with great difficulty and a hell of a lot of potions. And you guys don't want to see that. Oh, Bill. I'm so sorry. You did so well for me. Look at the power that is in this PC. Look at the power that is in this death box. There is so much power. Ugh, right, who are we taking to replace Bill? We don't have that ice resist now. We've still got an ice resist. But we don't have that particular ice resist. Empoleon's not a bad shout. Get Pinga. Or oh, Fairy's not a bad shout. Or we just go for the simple Yamask. We go for the simple Yamask. You know what? I've never I've never used a Yamask. I've never used a Copagrigus. So we're gonna go for it. Alright, in between episodes I'm gonna teach TMs to some Pokemon and I'm gonna research what we're supposed to be doing and then next episode I will come back with a bit more of a clue because this has not been not been great <laughs> probably quite entertaining but not been great okay we're gonna end off here thank you very much for watching guys i hope you have enjoyed it if you have then please do leave a like comment and subscription down below your support and your interactions are really appreciated you know that uh but with that we are gonna get up out thank you very much for watching guys and i will see you next time stay brave guys